Maybe I can never want to take the map. No, I don't need to. I memorized the whole route on the plane. At least until Roman needs. <laughs> you make me feel good. I slept all the time. I know. After five Xanax. Of course you did. <laughs> I think I'm the sole reporter of traveling being a friend who fly. <laughs> uh, sometimes I even wonder how can you sit with me. And I wonder how you managed to get hired at the guide travel. Miracle, seriously. Uh, well, uh, you know... I think... They have seen the feeling that I have with my little girl. Oh. And, and they have been constrained to take me on board. Should I be jealous? I wouldn't say so. You know, we travel around the world together for five years and there is only one thing I wouldn't never stop. Uh-huh. To make photos. What does that mean? What does that mean? What does it mean? Okay, enough. You have okay, to leave some room on the memory card. Oh, We're in Romania, what? the queen of Eastern Europe. And let's oh, go. Yeah. Look. The cars are behind us. It means that starting from today, Romania shall have a new pretender to the throne. Right. <laughs> Can you answer, please? No, no, yes. And you're so good with Harold. Please, please. Oh, Harold, my friend. How are you? We have just landed. We are. Oh no, it has been a fantastic flight. Fantastic. Uh, there's no problem with the rented car. Don't worry. Well, we are on the road now. Oh, what? Uh, of course, I understand. Yeah. What? Okay, I understand. Okay, send me everything by mail. I shall check it immediately. Bye. Bye, Errol. Hmm, what happened? So, what? What are you saying? travel has brought a brief modification at the itinerary. Oh no. They've changed it again. Oh, God. Okay, let's go to a coffee shop and let's see what he says. <laughs> Have a coffee? Maybe. Yeah. I want two, three, four, five <laughs> fucking coffee. Oh, yeah, you want to beat the Xanax? <laughs> okay. I'm tired pocket. Sounds. It's not enough. <laughs> okay. That's really up. mild modification. They basically changed the whole route without consulting us. If you look good, there isn't so serious. They have eliminated some areas of Transylvania in order to allow us to have more time at our disposal when we arrive in the interior. The areas that we have to omit are Bikas, mm. Sucheva, and Targunimt. Bas, Louis. Which means I have to say goodbye to visiting my father, which was the main reason why I took this job. You know that. Give me the phone. I'm calling Harold. No, wait, wait. Let's think. Who said that we can do more things? You know, Harold can be a good friend, but when it comes to work, he doesn't make any exceptions. If we don't deliver the job on time, with the photos and the article, he's going to replace us. We'll be gone like this. You know that. Okay, okay. Leave her for one second. Look here. More or less, uh, looking at the map, Vaslu is located at a distance of maximum 85 kilometers of Roman. Mm. And the flight for return is in one month, right? Mm, yeah, October, check, October, yeah, October 28th, yeah. Fortunately, guide travel conferred us the maximum period of time to, for visiting the region. 
And if we want, we can make ourselves comfortable until on 50th and finish with the guide of Romania in only two weeks. Mm. Do you remember how much time did it need to make Germany? Ten days. But the important thing to mention was that the route was way shorter. Ah, the stages were more. We visited villages that my bed didn't indicate. It was an enormous work to do, remember? We shall do it, trust me. It would be absurd not to visit your father. Visit now that my we father. Okay, visit your father. <laughs> now that we have it on our route. Imagine it. But I guess we will need a few days, huh? Of course. We can find a hotel. We shall take a dinner in a good restaurant. Mm -hmm. uh, right. And <laughs> we can continue our travel. Harold will never know about it. Uh, excuse me. Do you know how much distance there is until arriving to Vast Louis? No entiendo nada. Hablo solo español. Um, it's going to be so hard to find someone who speaks English or Italian. Escúchame, tengo una pregunta. ¿A cuántos kilómetros la Vast Louis? Algo como 20, 25 kilómetros, no más. ¿Y qué van a hacer allá? What you say? To go to the big mountains. Why? Si am spuska en Romania son chudats. Oh. Did you understand? Do you know that when you speak into Romania, you're extremely sexy? Yeah. And do you know when you're speaking your Italian English, you're even sexier? <laughs> uh, So you like my Romanian? My dad always spoke to me since I was a little girl. But my mom, she hated it. She couldn't stand it. She always said, I don't want my daughter to learn this language. Serious? Yeah. She's crazy. Oh, look. It's so beautiful. Let's stop here. Oh, my God. You always have to go a certain distance from the big city to realize what you have, how beautiful it is. It's true. You realize that a person is important only when she's gone. My love, everything's okay? You remember your father again. Mm. I didn't want this, sorry. 
You know, sometimes even I think of my Sicily origin. But I just can't believe that he's dead. He was so full of life at 60 years old and... It just seems like he's preserved every fiber of this land. Was he so connected to Romania? He never stopped speaking about it. Especially in his last days, he always repeated his desire to be buried in the country where he was born. In a cemetery forgotten by God. We have to go and find it. Miriam, Miriam. None of the cemeteries forgotten by God. And finally, we are here. Thank you for coming all the way here with me. Seriously. It means the world to me. Would you prefer another photographer? You know I only like to work with you. Ah, well, I know it very well, but it seems that Harold doesn't want to understand this. Because mm -mm. do you know who he proposed to work with me? No. Nah. Robert Nasty, <laughs> your favorite one. <laughs> that big. Yeah. <laughs> but just because he bought me a drink doesn't mean that he's a... Stop, stop! Bo, Bo what happened? Oh, slow down! You know the road! I can't let them escape! They're not here! Jesus, slow down, you're making me sick! I don't know, maybe they're cut out for some time. No, they're from here, they're hiding somewhere, Jesus Christ! We're so stupid. We should have checked this before renting the car. Uh, who would ever know that we should be robbed after less than an hour of traveling? I don't know. We have to find a mechanic workshop. Okay, but we also have to file the claim like the police requires in the country. Remember, we signed the papers. First, we have to change a wheel. I, we cannot move from this place. Okay, well, do you want to go? I don't know. Do you want to go there? Or do you want to go back? I don't know. The excavated road can continue for several kilometers, but I can't remember from where did it come to see an mechanic workshop. Okay, let's take the backpacks and let's go ahead, let's follow the thieves. They're just, they, they don't know what to do with the tablet or the phone. They might even lose it on the street. We don't know, they're just two vagabonds. It would be a miracle. Yeah, so can we do that, please? In the tablet, I had everything. Numbers, contacts. Our photos. Our photos? Our photos? Our photos! Fuck! What 
eat that. Check out those animals. She looks like a bitch. Huh? The foreigner hoarded with pigs. <laughs> You like this kind of women? Hmm? No, 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 no. I don't like the kind of women. I know women like that. No, 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 not like this. Look, you put your finger here and blows it like a newspaper. You're stupid, huh? You're mute, not blind, huh? Can you imagine? Can you see them here, right in front of the wall? Hmm? <laughs> bitches, yes, bitches. See that? Dragomir, bitches! Dragomir, bitches! Huh? Yeah, I want her. I want her. Look. <laughs> Dragomir, happy? What are you doing? Stop it! Don't do that! You need to control yourself! Who cares about the bottle? We have this and this! Technology! Mihail and Bogdan will make a lot of money from this if they find a buyer. Can you imagine how Daniela will be if she got this new cell phone? Huh? Hello? 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 Daniela? Hello? Hello? Daniela? Hello? Dragomir? Hello? I said that tourism is a honey resource. Okay, man. Let's go home. Give me the bag. Stop. Don't do that! Stupid mute. Please, Miriam, stop! The situation is very pitiful. It has no sense to make it worse. But you said you would transfer the photo onto your desktop. Why didn't you do that? Fuck, I did it. Or did I have forgotten to delete those from the tablet? Oh, forgotten. Poor you. Why don't you just admit that, that, that you didn't want to do that? You always want to do this. Okay, well, what is so bad? Do you want to keep some spicy photo of my love? That right now, some two guys that we don't know are getting off on our photos. They're getting off on our naked photos. It's going to end up on the internet. They're, they're going to sell it. I don't Mary, know what's going to happen. Calm down. Maybe they didn't even succeed in opening the tablet. Have you seen them? It seems as if to go out from a fucking madhouse. Very hot here. There's a track ball. There's a car. I'm gonna go talk to them. Should I go? Okay, go. Excuse me, can you please help us? We had a flat tire, we don't have the spare. Do you know any mechanic or anything in the area? So you want me to help you or not? Please. And him? Paul. English? No, Italian. Ciao. Mm. We're journalists working on a tourist guide for Romania. We're stuck. Don't you know tourists like Bucharest, Sibiu? Hell, maybe even Constanza. But definitely nothing around here. No, we know, but we are interested more in the whole of Romania, especially the, the lesser known areas, right? Then this is it. <laughs> we have ourselves some houses, some horses, a pharmacy, and a cemetery. <laughs> that about covers it.
<laughs> come. <laughs> come, come. Let me take you where you need to go. from this cesspool. Sounds just like my father. He's Romanian as well. But he moved to Italy a long time ago. Met my mom. Got married. He made a good living too, but the only wish that he had at the very end was to be buried here where he was born. What did you say your name was again? I didn't. It's Miriam. Miriam Damien. Damien. Alexandru Damien is your father. Yes, did you know him? Everyone knows everyone out here. I was at his funeral. I don't remember seeing you there. No, I couldn't go. I was traveling for work. I worked for a low-budget newspaper, and unfortunately, Romania is not a very likely destination, not even for travel journalists. Alexandru Damien, wow! What are the odds of that? Damien of Damien Cookie Shop. Yes, he, he sold them also in Italy. Shit! So sorry, man. Leave them. I'll get them later. Doesn't compare to selling Damien's cookies. But I get a few dollars for them, you know? Wait until tomorrow. But it's not even six o'clock. People make their own hours here. Chiedi se si può trovare una fottuta stazione di servizio da qualche parte qui. Dobbiamo solo cambiare una cazzo di gomma. He wants to know if there's any gas station. We only have to change a tire. Please, can you help us? Twenty minutes away. I can take you now. No, it's okay. We've taken enough of your time. We'll, we'll walk. <laughs> time is all I have. Plus, the least I can do for Damien. Thank you. We're good. Oh, wait. Hello. Quoi? Non, je l'ai pas vendu, merde. Je t'ai dit, je l'ai pas vendu. Écoute, j'ai deux journalistes devant moi. Des journalistes. J'ai la fille de Damien devant moi. La fille de Damien, je vous le dis, merde. Allô? Allô? My sister. She said, don't forget to bring the milk. So it was really great meeting you. We're, we're, we're just gonna, we're gonna walk. How long are you in town for? I don't know, until we fix the car. Your father and I, we were good friends. I was sitting in the front row at his funeral. Have fun in Romania. Don't forget to write in your article about Bogdan. 
See you soon. Can I know why you do get off? I didn't like the guy at all. Did you see all the bottles in his car? So what? The two thieves had two backpacks full of them, too. Maybe the... Look, he was... I don't know. He just brought me the wrong way. Paul, he knew my father. Oh, Miriam, please. In a locality where they use the number of inhabitants, it would have been stranger country. Don't you think so? No, I, I know you're right, but... It's just, it's the way he looked at us. Did you see his eyes? He was scary. I know it. You know I have that feeling. And then on the phone, he spoke in an accent that I've never heard before. He said he knew the daughter of Damien or something like that. Damien? It's my dad's name. He knows my father. Look, if I wouldn't want to see his grave, I would get out of here right away. I'm telling you. You know I have that feeling. It's not... We have to be careful. Oh. Vasile, Dragomir. How much did you get for the bottles? I didn't sell the bottles. What did you do with them? Where is the sack? Leave me alone. You don't know nothing. You don't know nothing. You don't know nothing. Where did you get this? Vasile! One mute is enough. Where did you get this? What is he trying to say? He stole a computer and a cell phone. Go. Go now. Get me my money for the bottles. Now! Well, we shouldn't have left the main road. The indications for the cemetery effects indicate the forest. I know, but we should have been there by now. We've been walking for an hour. Let's go back. We're getting lost. Okay, what time is it? It's, uh, it's 7.30. Let's go. Short period of time, it will get dark. That's sorry, Miriam. No, exactly. Let's go back, Paul. Please, I'm. Come on, Miriam. Paul, please, please, we can come back tomorrow. I'm here to protect you. No, don't be no, afraid. No, 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 please, no, no, no. I don't. Please, let's go back. I'm sorry. Please, I'm just so scared. Why did you put your exit down? I can't walk. I'm not going anywhere. I'm just tired, please. 
Paul, let's stay here. We're gonna continue tomorrow. Mira, when I... the sun comes up, please. Are you nuts? Do you want us to stop here in the middle of nowhere? I'm not Come nuts. On. Let's go. We almost arrived. If we're gonna go, we're gonna get lost. It's gonna get worse, please. Okay. I'm so scared. Okay, okay. Then okay. You're right. You're right. How much water do we have? Check. Oh, it's nothing. Hey, listen. Can you hear? What is it? The noise of a torrent. A torrent? Yes, I can hear. Let's fill up the bottle. We may need it. No, please. No, I'm not going anywhere. Paul, I'm scared. I, I, it's dark. It We're comes go from, tomorrow. It comes from there. We descend a little bit, just a little bit. And if you don't find it around, we shall stop to looking for it, OK? And we try to find a, some good place so safe to sleep. Okay? Trust okay, me. Okay, okay, fine. Okay. okay. Come on. Okay, wait, wait. You know what pisses me off? No. They always persuade me. Why did you get this? Found it. Where? I don't know, around. Give it to me, it's mine. Where did you get the money to buy it? It's not your fucking business. Who's Julika? No. Listen, if you don't give it to me, police will take you and you'll go to jail. Away from Daniela. I ain't gonna go to jail. Give me this fucking phone. Right now. Fine, you can have it. You didn't buy the phone. You stole it. You did? No. You stole it? No. Yeah, you're no. a thief. No. I'm going to tell you. You should be mute. Huh? You should be mute. Are you okay? Oh. Oh. Can you walk? No. Oh my god, I sprained my ankle. Oh my god. We have no food. Try not to enter in panic. Calm down. Yeah, yeah but we're, we're, what are we gonna do? I can't walk. Paul! Okay. Uh, I walk to the river. I fill up the bottle and I shall return. Take this. Take! Paul, don't leave me alone. Don't worry. Miriam! Miriam! Can you hear me? Miriam! Miriam, where are you? Miriam! Miriam! Me 
Deacon! Yeah, help me! Finger over. Dead. Meet Miriam Damien, the daughter of Alexandru Damien. What are we going to do now? Get even. What happened to the other one? I couldn't catch him. Doesn't matter. This is our meal ticket. We could finally get money in our pocket. Get away from the shithole. think she's breathing. What did you do to her? She's alive. She was breathing 10 minutes ago. She don't look so good. Check on her, you fool. I don't want to touch her. I'm not going to let you fuck this up. You hear me? I'm not going to touch her. Go check on her goddamn body now. I don't want to touch her. Why don't you stop drinking? Say it again. Say it again, and I'll make that yellow widow so fast her head will spin. Just watch where you're going. <laughs> Tell you to remain inside. Just full. Finally, you came home. Did you have lunch? Was it good? Yeah, it was good. What is it? We found it by the side of the road. There's blood inside. Probably belongs to a hunter or something. We'll wash it off. I'm tired. I'm going to sleep. Mickey. You came home very late. What? Mickey, what happened again? What? What? Talk to me. What did you get, please? I bought it for my money. I don't want to ever see you eating those again. 
Do you hear me? Next time use your money, which is really my money, and pay the damn electricity bill before they cut it off. Leave. Leave now. Well, well. I told you I'd see you again. Drink. If you speak, I will leave you here to die of thirst. Clear? tell you, karma's a bitch and she's finally by my side. Let me tell you about your father. I trusted him. I trusted him with everything I had. I gave him my money from the farm. What the fuck are you doing? So we can open up business overseas together. Just like a Damien to think that he could outsmart me. Took my money, transferred it to another account. And just like that, you it's see gone. Her. She's a wall from the computer. And I have every bill collector <gasps> knocking on my door to take the bread from my mouth. If it wasn't for that bastard, my wife would be alive. But what does your wife have to do with us here? Shut up and drink! Facci sta da Gami Godot, vediamo a coppa il piano. Ok, andiamo? Andiamo lì, andiamo lì.
Yeah. Uh, excuse me. I'm looking for a girl. Maybe she passed through those sides. Miguel, what's happening? It's nothing. It's nobody. It's a mistake. Who's there? I don't know who it is. Oh, what do you want? She's, she's not here. There's no girl here, man. No, I'm sorry, buddy. Please. She's after the naked. Hey. She can't move There's nobody much. here. I don't speak Italian, all right? I speak English. There's no girl here, man. What's going on here? No, no, What's going on out there? Man, there's some fool outside about looking for some girl. Ah, the Italian journalist. Where's your lady friend? What was her name? Oh, yes, Miriam. Where is she? Wait. Disappear. Is that even possible for such a small town? Mika, you see such a lady? You see such a girl? Mm -mm. I, I need a phone. You got it? There's no phone around here, man. <laughs> phone disconnected. And my cell phone don't work so well. So well, sorry. Then, what's happening here? To whom are you talking? Daniela. The Italian woman. journalist. Meet the Italian journalist. What? He's looking for some woman. He thinks she's here somewhere. Oh. Uh, hello? Uh, she, she's not here. He, he's... My name is Daniela. This is my wife. You want to eat lunch with us? You want to eat our lunch? You hungry? No! I need to find Miriam! I need to find my girlfriend! Get out of here, I told man. you! Just get out. Get out of here, I man. need my girlfriend! Get out of here, man. Miki, what's happening? Tourists. What? Fuck! Get out of here, man. Miki. Miki. Go make food. <laughs> Mike. <laughs> now, now it's your time. Choose what you want to do. And then it's my turn. You do what you want to do, okay? You just have to choose. Then it's my turn. Look here. What do you think? Do you like this? Huh? If you want a blow job, you have to take off some duct tape. But it's dangerous. It is better. What do you think? Because with a blow job, she can bite you. And I'm on this shit. Go, go, go. Bitch. 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 Shh. Shut up. What's it worth? About three, four hundred dollars. Does this piece of shit thing still work? Can we check online? It's all disconnected, so is the phone. Bastards. Where the fuck is the other thing? I thought you had it. Miguel? Bogdan? The Italian is back. Oh, shit. <laughs> Treat our guests bad? Huh? 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 Oh, no. oh, 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 oh. Oh my God, can we know what happened this time? 
What did they do again? He's killing them. Sometimes I think it's better to mind your business and not get involved. I do interfere, Michael. I do interfere. Young men don't need leathering, but they need someone that loves them. There are almost three years. Dragomir doesn't say a word. And if it, go it goes like that, he will remain mute for his life. He misses his mother. Yes, Michael, I know. We all miss Alexandra. But it would be easier if they would have a normal father. And there is an uncle here. That's you, Michael. That can be heard from time to time. In time, maybe I will. What are you doing? You sit and drink vodka. That's the only answer you can give. All right, now that's all I have. Then, I have some more. I thank you. <laughs> Visto? Ho avuto la soffiata. Sono Ito l'americano. Hanno fittato la macchina all'aeroporto di Bacow. Questa storia non mi piace per niente. Sicuramente se ne era pieno, se scantaro. Non volevano pagare a ruota e se ne ero. Ma che stai dicendo? Ma sai chi è Miriam Damian? Ma come chi la conosci? Ecco, appunto, andiamo a risolvere il caso. E a morire, forse. See how your good-for-nothing whore has cost you? In the end, you're all bitches, just like your father. Come, we gonna make movie now. make movie now.
Action. My name is Miriam Damien. I am being held hostage with my boyfriend, Paul Bell. <laughs> they can never ask me for a ransom of three million euros. <laughs> Please help us. <laughs> the, the money should be left at. I will get my money. So you do it properly. <laughs> <laughs> Again. <laughs> my, my name is Miriam Damien. I'm being held hostage with my partner, Paul Villa. Can you please help us? <laughs> The kidnappers are asking for three, three million euros as a ransom. The money should be left at, at the address that they're going to show. Please, Please, we need your help. Good. I know you're awake. I could hear you mumbling from the hall. Look, I'm sorry. I know I went overboard today, but you bastards deserve it. Is that any way to treat your guests? But I want you to know things are going to change around here for the entire family. Which includes getting you new bikes. What kind? Mountain bikes. For Christmas? Christmas. October, latest November. And we're gonna start our farm business and our agriculture business. Like when Anisandra was alive? Yes. Exactly. Did you sell the phone? Yes, and that other thing too. <laughs> so, we did good then. 
Yes, but you were bad to our guests. You can't tell anyone, or the police will lock you up for good. Okay. Do you understand, Dragomir? Who will read the newspaper this time? It was right here. I told you we should have came last night. That's where they had the flat tire. The police probably came and took it away. Ah, fuck. Come. Come on, Mike. Non è tuo padre, ma non è mica Sadea. Non è vostro padre. The father is not here. The father left with my husband. Stiamo cercando questi ragazzi, sono ruito all'americano che scomparirono, signora, per caso gli vitti. They arrived from America by car? No. Tagliasse buono, vedi se per caso ti riconosce a chi sei qua. The girl I have never seen her in my life. Ah, but the boy, yes. Yes, I saw him, beautiful boy. Yes, he was here several days ago. I remember, yes. He was here several days ago. I'm absolutely sure I have seen him twice. For the first time, he seemed he had left. But afterwards, I have seen him again, walking around this yard, looking in a strange manner, yeah. Posso fare un giro, signora? No problem. And it won't last long. There is nothing left from agro-tourism. The police is here, but everything is okay. I did not talk. How many? One. You want to check out the house, but Daniela takes him to the roof. Shit. Oh my God. Let's get out of here. That, uh... Anyway, on this side, I never come. I don't like... 
I feel a sort of discomfort. Once here there was a beautiful gazebo where it took place with tremendous lunges. The grass was cut a centimeter. Every angle was cured for perfection. I speak, of course, for the time when my mother-in-law was still alive. A signora Bogdan. <laughs> si. A signora Bogdan. Oh, she was beautiful. Oh, she was the most famous for agro-tourism ladies. Meschina, la vicina molto brutta. The idea of the bomb was also hers. My brother has his own faults, but he's not a criminal. Non voglio rivagare il passato, signora, ma qua vicino c'è qualche casolare, qualche pollaio, qualche cantina. Ah, uh, uh, yes, oh yes. It's an old roost. It became a sort of uh, garage for all vehicles. Yeah. Hey, don't know. In the field, with grass. But I don't recommend you go there, no. no. Nobody goes there for years. It may be dangerous. I don't know what the conditions are. No problem. Ci voglio solo. As you wish. But I don't come with you. No? No. I don't want to enter in the jungle. No. Si preoccupi. Ci voglio solo. Okay, you go. Daniela. Yeah? You never mentioned we have a, a guest. Oh. Agent Piconi. Can I offer you something? Coffee? No, grazie, magari dopo il caffè. Adesso mi devi dire se per caso hai visto questo italiano. Yeah, you don't recognize them. What? Mike! Yeah. I've never seen either one of them. Not around here. Bogdan! Don't recognize them. Ma che minchia stai dicendo se tu solo riesci a cantare una parrocuttia, Cristo? Controlla oh, bene. The Italian. It didn't click immediately he was a foreigner. You know, I'm not so good with faces. We never see foreigners around here. Not since the uh, agricultural business. Ci parlaste o non ci parlaste con Cristo? Yes, I did. He said he was looking for his business partner. Vabbè, mi vado a fare un giro, un girettino, mo vengo. No, no, uh, you know, wait, wait, <laughs> Agent Piconi, it, it's, it was destroyed last, uh, last year in, uh, during the rainfall, you know, so I don't think it's good for you to go and see right now. Right, uh, Mike? There's nothing in there. You can go look if you want, but there's nothing in there. It's a bunch of rats. Okay, okay, abbiamo capito, abbiamo capito, va bene così, okay. I told you I have never... Agent Piconi. Dimmi. You sure you don't want a coffee? No, grazie. Magari un'altra volta. Però stai in campana, che io ti tengo d'occhio. Ciao. What did you say? Uh, I, I, What did you say? I, I told him the truth. I told him that... What did you say? The boy, the boy was here by our door. I, I, I told him. What? You stupid. What did I... Get it! Can we know what's happening? Why did you escape in that manner when the police officer arrived here? I never escaped. You have problems. Again. I never escaped, I swear. Don't lie to me. Don't lie to me. Leave him alone. Isn't it good enough he has to deal with your cooking? Uh, listen, Bogdan. 
if you would be able to bring home something more decent, then we wouldn't be forced to eat soup every evening, every day. Soup every day, soup every day, and again soup. We interrupt this program to bring you a special news report. The investigations regarding the two American Shut journalists up. that left from Corleone on 28 this August continue. The traces of Miriam Damian and Paul Vela were lost in the county of Roman Nels. Investigators don't exclude the possibility of a kidnapping, even if until now no reward was requested. Damien. They say Damien. I told you to shut it off. No, no, no. Maybe she's a relative of Alexandro. Maybe you ought to shut off the radio. The one with the biscuit. Yeah, maybe the sky will turn green tomorrow. I, I heard they buried him here, in the village. Is that true? The one who brought us to misery. Well, I can't make money with biscuits. <sighs> Vasilika, stop saying nonsense. Come. I need you to come with me. I forgot to tell you something. But wait, wait. Can you tell him after lunch? We can't even eat in this house. You call this shithole a house? We're moving them out tonight. Once those helicopters start hovering over us, we might as well be good as dead. Where are you gonna put him? The old pit. I'll take care of it. You're out. Fine with me, buddy. I didn't want to have nothing to do with it in the beginning. News reporter said no ransom was ever made. That's because I didn't send the DVD. When you had the chance. Why don't you go back to those losers inside? Go eat that bullshit food of your wife! Fuck you, man. Mike! Mike! This old pit has quite a history. I'm sure you journalists will appreciate it. It belonged to a peasant, a good-for-nothing man who spent his day caressing his granddaughter beneath her dress. Until one day, she ran and fell into the pit. The son of a bitch tried to pull her out, but lost his balance, fell in, crushing her to her death. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. And then, when the time came, people came to help. Let her go, bug. Mika, I told you I could handle it alone. Go home. Miriam, you run up that hill. I never liked you, you fuck. Turn around and get yours. Mike. <laughs> Run up that hill. Run away. No, you don't want to do this. 
I suggest you go now. Don't do it. Don't do it, please. Don't do it, Bob. Please, don't do it. I'm Damien. I've been kidnapped. I lost my boyfriend, Paul. Can you please help us? Tranquil, 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 tranquil. Salutiamo. Tieni. Non ci sono stati per me. Devo controllare. Figlia mia, come sta? Miriana è sana e salva. Amico suo ancora è vivo. Arrivò l'ambulanza al nuovo posto. Bogdan morì. Ora tocca a Bossia.
Moet ik de geest. Don Ciro, i patti sono out. Lei deve mantenere la parola. Quale accordo, secondo voi? L'accordo era di portare la sua figlia sana e salva. E chi sto figimo? E o perché, sapete, o perché? O perché a noi non ne interessa. Sono problemi vostri. Noi abbiamo i problemi nostri. Ti ricordi la prima volta che sei messo in uniforme? Avevi in mente, forse, che poteva sal salvare tutto il mondo. Ma ha fatto conto... Uh, capivo che tu sei un uomo proprio come tutti gli altri. Ma Don Ciro, che cosa vuoi da noi? Noi abbiamo intenzioni migliori, non è vero? Non è vero? Sì, è vero. Ah. Per essere migliore protettore, marito, papà. Io mi pidivo, io non ci stavo capendo niente. Io mi stavo pidendo. O non capisco proprio di chi sta dicendo. Pure io ero perso. La colpa mia. Ho lasciato che ho bolena mi entrava dentro i vene, dentro il sangue mio proprio. Mi sono diventato un guscio di nuovo. E non sopportare la vista della mia figlia. Sua figlia è viva. È viva sua figlia. La picciotta è viva. Ogni volta mi guardava. Io vedevo solamente la faccia della mamma e ho tradimento. Basta con la confessione, mica sono un prete, abbiamo un accordo. Era solo una bambina. Che colpa aveva? Era la mamma che mi ha ingannato come amica mia, come una prostituta. Mm. Era più facile mettere in scena un mio funerale invece di vivere col dolore a disgusto. Quest'odio che consumava ogni pensiero, ogni pensiero amico. Un te il in terra, capo. In fin dei conti, c'era solo la fotografia tua nella tomba. Non c'era la fotografia di tua figlia che moriva. Et la trop longue table brune est habillée de chandeliers. Et la trop longue table brune est habillée de chandeliers. Dans ce château qui est étrange. Les gens s'amusent à raconter qu'il y eut autrefois un ange, autant jadis, autant passé, et que trop faible et d'une femme dans la tour ronde, la ronde, et que trop faible et d'une femme. Dans la tour ronde, la ronde Ceci explique bien des choses Entre autres cette mélopée Qui vient du soir quand le soir tombe Et que la tour est éclairée la, 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 la. J'habite un grand château des ronces où les roseaux peuvent pousser les pieds mouillés dans le silence qui neige que 
le soir au coucher. 